from Stick Only coming back at you again for another installment here. We're going to have some fun today and work on some skills. So what we're going to work on today, again, we did our Burdener on Tuesday. We are going to do our Catalyst Athletics Snatch Primer warm-up today. So we'll take that down once we get our bodies a little bit more warmed up. First things first, though, let's get our bodies a little bit ready to go. So we'll get our feet underneath of our hips or just outside. My grip is going to come nice and wide. And we're just going to start by doing some gentle high pulls. So pulling the elbows back and up, getting the bar to the sternum, and then coming back down. And then back and up, and then back down. Back and up, and back down. We're just going to walk our hands in a little bit. We're going to do that same thing. So back and up, and back down. Back and up, and back down. Up and down. We're going to come right in to the hips or thumb distance away from the hips. And we're going to go back and up and down, back and up and down, back and up and down. Good. We're going to take it back out to that snatch grip now. We're going to take it up to the sternum and slow turn over into that overhead position. Then we'll come back down. Pull to the sternum, slow turnover into that good overhead position again. Come back down one more time, pull to the sternum, turn it over, and then pull that bar down behind the neck. We're going to get our feet out to our squat stance so we have some room to rotate. We're going to squeeze the glutes. We're going to pull the hips back into our good morning. Wake up the hamstrings, then stand tall, and then take a big breath. Rotate low ribs those legs still and then come back through inhale low rib rotate come back through good squeeze the glutes pull the hips back and we'll come back up and rotate low ribs come back through rotate low ribs come back through and one more time pull back nice good morning Stand tall and rotate. And back through. Rotate. And back through. Excellent. We'll bring those feet back under the hips. And just outside, toes can be turned out. We're going to work on that nice dip. So we're going to work that vertical dip. Knees going slightly out, hips under the shoulders. So squeeze your glutes. Dip and hold. Just waking up the ankles and the hips a bit. Stand tall. Dip and hold. Nice and Vertical, stand tall, and dip and hold, and stand. Press the bar up. I'm going to bring the bar back down to that high hang position. I'm going to start by warming up those positions again by pulling those hips back and those knees going slightly out as we take the bar to mid-thigh. Let's turn those palms forward, open up the biceps again, take hold of the bar, take the bar to launch. So again, wing through the midfoot, shoulders just in front of the bar. Then we're going to turn those hands forward just to feel those lats. Open up the biceps and the chest a bit, then take hold. We're going to lower everything down, chest and hips to below the knee. Same way through the feet as we turn those hands forward. Turn them back over, grip the bar. Push through those legs all the way to the hip. We're going to push the legs more, muscle snatch, come down behind the neck, step our feet out to our squat stance, and then we're going to take a nice big breath and do a pressing snatch balance. Big breath and press yourself down under the bar into that good overhead squat. Nice and active and stand. Good. We're going to come back with the feet, bring those hands down into the front of the high hang, and we get ready to do it again. Take the bar to mid thigh, knees go slightly out, big toes are down, palms forward, come back through, take the bar to launch, palms forward, set, now come back down just below the knee, palms forward, open up that chest and bicep a little bit, take hold, stand the bar all the way up to the hip, push through those legs, muscle snatch. Good, come down behind the neck. We'll shimmy the feet out again. Get set, big breath. Press yourself down underneath that bar. Super slow, set. 
and stand. Good. Feet come back under. Bar comes back down. Good. Let's do that one more time. And then we'll move into our primer. So take the bar, the mid-thigh, shoulders just in front of the bar, weight through the midfoot, palms turn face forward. Take hold. Take the bar down to launch. Palms face forward. Take hold. Everything lowers down below. Palms. Take hold. Now stand that bar up to the hip. Push through the legs. Yeah. Muscle snatch. Come back down behind. Shimmy our feet out to our squat stance. Take a big breath. Press yourself down. Nice and active. Yeah. And stand. Woo. Feet come back under. Bring the bar back to the hip. And take a moment to gather yourself and take a moment and get the breath in there. So now what we're going to do is we're going to work through our Catalyst Athletics Snatch Primer Warm-Up. So if you have a, a plate likes kind of stack or lift at home you can use, stay close to it. We can use that midway through for our soft press and or for our overhead squats if you'd like. So if not, no worries, just take it as deep as you can in terms of our positions. All right, so let's get our hands in our nice wide grip again, so our snatch grip. We're gonna start this warm up just like we started our, our official warm up with some high pulls. So we're gonna pull the bar high and outside to that nice sternum position. So pull for one, come back down. Pull for two, back down. Pull for three, and down. For four, and down. And five, and down. Now we're gonna do a tall muscle snatch. So we're gonna pull to the sternum, punch overhead, pull, punch. Come back down in reverse, tight to the glutes and ribs, pull, punch. Down, pull, punch. Good, come back down, two more. Pull to the sternum, punch. Turn over, nice and fast. Come back down, last one. Pull high and outside, punch. Come down behind the neck. Now we're gonna work on maintaining good overhead position. So glutes are tight, core is tight. We're gonna press the bar overhead. Come back to neutral. Overhead, to the back rack. For three, to the back rack. Four, pressing into that overhead position. And five, keep it there. We're gonna step our feet to our squat stance and overhead squat, take it down. Keep pressing into the bar the entire time and stand. Good, we're always pushing up into that PVC. Squat and stand, good. For three and stand, good. For four, good. Now we're gonna hold the bottom on this one. Take it down, good position. Shoulder and press. Shoulder, press. Shoulder, press. Shoulder, press. One more time. Shoulder, press, stand. And back to the shoulders. Nice, you guys. Let's bring the feet back under the hips. Now we're going to work on some snatch drops, or drop snatch. We're going to press ourselves quickly under the bar. So we're always pressing into the bar. There's no down up on this, so there's no momentum. We're just driving ourselves under. Eyes straight ahead, glutes tight. Take a big breath. Go! Stand tall. Feet come under. Receive the bar. Get set. Tight. Go! Stand. Feet come under, come down, nice and set. Go! Stand, feet come under, down, two more, nice big breath. Go! Stand tall, feet come under, back down, last one, big breath. Go! Stand, feet under, bar to the hand. Now, from here we're going to work the tall snatch. I'm going to turn to the side, and with this, we're going to pull ourselves down into the bottom of our overhead squat. We want to make sure, though, when we pull the bar, we're pulling that bar in a bar path like our tall muscle snatch. So we keep it close. We don't want it going out here, in that dislocated. We want to keep it nice and close. So feet are 
through the hips, so just outside. Eyes straight ahead. Big breath. Go! Stand tall, pressing into that bar. Feet come under. Bar comes back down. Get set. Go! Stand. Feet come back under. Bar comes down. Set. Go! Stand. Feet come back under. Bar comes down. Two more. Go! Stand. Feet under. Bar comes down. Last one. Go! Stand. Feet come under. Bar comes down. Whew. All right. Now, we've worked on pulling ourselves down into that deep squat. We've worked on driving ourselves down, all emphasizing that strong punch and turnover. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna come back to that drill we worked on Tuesday, the other day, and we worked on that high pull hold. So our sequence of events is taking us down the body. We started from the high hang, we moved to mid thigh, now we're gonna go to launch. And the only difference here is we just need a little bit more patience before we accelerate. So what we're gonna do, it's gonna look like so. I'm gonna turn to the side so you guys can see. My feet will be under my hips, so just outside. I'll take the bar to launch. So just above my knee, my shoulders are just in front of the bar. My weight's through my feet, midfoot. I'm gonna push through my feet, standing up, drive into that finish. So those straight arms, that high shoulder. I'll come down again, and I'm gonna move into the high pull hold. Practicing. So heels and hands turn over at the same time. And then we're going to snatch from launch. So we're going to do those three exercises building and having some fun with those. So, with your receiving position of the snatch, depending on how you're feeling, you can receive it power, you can work your weight down deeper as you warm up more, you can take it all the way down. I want you to make sure you're hitting the bottom of your snatch and making sure you're pushing to your edge so we can maintain our positions. So, let's do our first rep together. Wide grip, snatch grip. Toes slightly turned out just outside the hips. We're gonna get that finish first. So let's take it to launch, nice and smooth. Set, finish. Good. Now high pull hold. Take it down to launch. Set. Go. Go! Good turnover. Come back down. And now we're going to snatch. Take it to launch. Move your feet, your shoulders. Snatch. Stand tall. Feet come under. Bar comes down. Good. All right, let's do that again. I'm going to face the front for you guys. So feet underneath. Nice and tall. Take it to launch. So just over the knee. Your feet, through your shoulders, finish. Good. High pull hold. Let's take it down through your feet, shoulders. Go. Go. Good turnover. Come back down. Now we're gonna snatch. Take it down to launch through your feet. Set. Snatch. Stand tall. Feet come under. Bar comes down. Excellent. One more time. I'm going to turn, face this direction now. Let's take the bar, down the launch, through your feet, weight through the midfoot, finish. Good. Good. Now, take it down, set, high pull hold. Go! Good. Come back down. Now we're going to snatch. Take it to launch. Awesome. Nice work, you guys. Now, if you'd like to do a couple more of those reps, pause the video, take those reps down, or scroll back, watch and do them with me again. But it's a nice opportunity to work on that patience, getting that bar up to that point, that contact point when we want to go vertical and drive into those different positions. All right? Each one working on a slightly different thing. That tall finish, that turnover, and then that full bringing it all together, that full 
old stash. So really nice work, you guys. Nicely done. Now we're going to move into a work set. So we've been working on pulls to the hip, high pulls, snatches, all that good stuff. So what we're going to do this time is we're going to work on a nice pull from below the knee to the hip. We're going to move into launch. We're going to get that nice high pull again. And then we're going to go from that high hang. Then we're going to bring it all together with a pull snatch. All right. So the sequencing will be pull to hip, high pull, high hang snatch, and then a pull snatch. All right. So I'm going to turn to the side. We'll get you guys going. Feet are underneath of the hips or just outside. Nice and tall. Let's take the bar smoothly down to launch. And then we'll drop the hips and shoulders together so we come down to below the knee. You feel that engagement, that pull flat foot contact. Let's push through the legs, stand to the hip. Now we're going to take it to launch. Now we're going to do that snatch high pull. Go. Good. Now high hang snatch. Vertical dip. And snatch. Stand tall. Feet come under. Bar goes down. Now we're going to take it to below the knee and snatch. Nice and smooth. Take it to below. Set. Feel your feet. Tight. Go. Stand tall. Feet. Take that bar down to the knees, and then everything comes down together. So we're below the knee, weight through the midfoot, shoulders just in front of the bar, pull to hip, take it to launch, feel your feet, high pull, good, high hang snatch, down, stand tall, feet come under, bar comes down, now let's take it to below the knee, Smooth, feel your position, snatch. Stand, feet come under, bar comes down. Nice, one more time you guys. Let's take it from that other direction. So, feet are under the hips, you're just outside, nice and tall. Let's take it down, and then hips and shoulders drop together, set, pull to hip. like to replay that or do a couple more reps, pause, scroll back, do them with me, or pause and do them on your own, taking down that nice sequence. So we build it up from the pull to the hip, little high pull, high hang, and then bring everything together to work on that pull snatch. So take your time, work through those if you want to do more reps of that, pause the video, take that down. We're going to go through some squat development and get you guys squared away. So first things first though, let's drop that PVC. Let's get those feet in our regular squat stance and let's take a nice smooth tempo squat down. Take it down, three, two, one, and stand. Just to feel that squat. See how it feels. Now we're going to get that PVC pipe back up in there. We're going to go narrow grip. So thumb and a thumb distance away from the knurling. We're going to pull the bar up, pop it on the shoulders, we're going to step into a nice wide stance. We're going to work that side lunge with the bar behind the shoulders on that back rack. So shoulders pinching together nice and strong so we have that strong upper body. We're going to take that hip down to the heel. Remember with the bar behind we may not get as deep and that's okay. Stand tall. Good. Other side. Hip to heel. Staying upright. And stand tall. Good. Pull back into a good morning. Stand tall. Again, taking it down, hip to heel. Stand her up, hip to heel. Nice and upright. Nice and tall. Squeeze your glutes. Good morning. Soft knees. Pull back up. One more time. Hip to heel. Tall, hip to heel, 
bring our feet back in. Now we're gonna stand in our squat stance, and I'm gonna turn to the side so you guys can see this. We're gonna do a Kang squat. And the Kang squat with this PVC behind the neck is gonna be a little tough, all right? So bear with me on this one. I'll show you another variation without the PVC. What we're gonna do is get our feet in our regular squat stance. We're going to pull the hips back into our good morning. And then once we get that tension in the hamstring, we're gonna pull those hips down into the bottom of our squat. And then we're gonna push the hips into that good morning, and then stand tall. Woo! So, variation without the PVC, we get rid of it. Same thing. We pull back in that good morning, and then we pull those hips down to our squat, push those hips into our good morning, and stand. So it's a little freer. So if you'd like to do this one without the PVC, please be my guest, all right? If you want to use the PVC, just know you may not get as deep in your squat as you normally can, and that's okay. Nice and tall, pull the hip back, feel that hamstring, pull into that squat, push into that good morning, stand tall, good. One more. Pull the hip back, pull into that squat, push into that good morning, and stand tall. Woo! Good. Now let's pop that bar up, bring it down to the front, take that grip wide. We're in our normal squat stance. We're gonna do a tall muscle snatch, pull and punch. Get those feet into that nice squat stance, press into that bar, and now let's do a five second Lower. Knock my headphone out. Alright. Five second low. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Holding, pressing into that bar. Standing for three, two, one. Good. Let's do that again. Five, four, three, two, one. Holding, pressing into that bar, standing for three, two, one. One more time, take it down, five, four, three, two, holding, pressing into that bar, standing for three, two, one. Bring the bar down, normal squat stance, we'll take that nice tempo squat down, three, two, one, and stand. Excellent. Hopefully, that squat, that last air squat there felt a little freer, a little more open. All right. Thank you for joining me today with some good old broomstick Oli. A good opportunity to play on some uh, good technique work and some good squat mechanics. Have a great day, you guys. Work for quality. Enjoy. We'll see you again very soon. Bye, you guys.